My friend is so much fun. He's always playing tricks on people. He is so smart. In fact, he's one of the most intelligent beings on the planet. This friend can literally see through me. And I'm not kidding. My friend races sailboats and always wins. My friend has no problem hitting a high no. My friend can surf waves 25 feet high with no board. I'd like to see you try that. This friend can understand us, but we can't understand him. He saves lives. He saves lives. He saved human lives. He's always smiling. But that doesn't mean that he's always happy. My friend doesn't belong in captivity. My friend does not belong in captivity. He doesn't belong in captivity. His home is in the ocean. But my friend is in serious trouble. In fact, he's fighting for his life right now. Right now. Right now. Off the coast of Japan, dolphins and porpoises are driven to a horrible fate. The most attractive are chosen for life in captivity. The others are brutally killed. Their meat, which contains toxic levels of mercury, is sold as food. Majority of people in Japan don't even know this is happening. Please help us end this senseless slaughter. Please help us get the word out. Please join us in getting the word out. Help us get the word out. Help us get the word out. We are their biggest threat and their only hope. 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 And their only hope.
museum, the Taiji, my old museum here in Taiji, which is right next door to the cove in which they capture the dolphins trapped inside here. Good morning. I'm a lawyer, Yoshida. I'm from Tokyo. The Action for Angel lawsuit is about helping Angel, the poor dolphin, and other dolphins which are trapped inside this museum. The museum's trying to hide these conditions and doing so in an illegal way. And that's what the complaint which we filed at Wakayama District Court against Taiji Town is about. ため Taiji Well Museum is behaving illegally by refusing entrance to law abiding people based on purely on their appearance. Are you Mr. Hayashi? She, uh, Ms. Uh, Sarah has a word with you, would like to have a word with you. Um, I'm Sarah Lucas. Sarah Lucas. This. Um, and this is Rick Obari. Oh, I'm Luke Obari is on this. Okay, so what do you want to achieve? What we would like to achieve is the same uh, right that the Japanese public has, access to the building, so we can get in and see how Angel is doing the rare albino dolphin that was captured. We would just like to see her, and they don't want us to do that. They're hiding something, and they're breaking the law in the process of hiding that something. We allege that, you're, that the conduct of the museum is illegal. He's asking, are you the one who has been rejected? Yes. In February, hi, so this. Go My, myself and others. Did you come alone in February? No, I came with another person, and this, I have a copy here of the complaint, which outlines this, if you would like it. Action for Angel is trying to help Angel, the albino dolphin who was ripped from her mother and is now in a tiny tank in the Taiji Whale Museum. As a first step to giving her a decent life, we want her to be released into a shaded, appropriate sea pen right outside the museum here, which is a feasible option. Yeah, there is something people can do. They can go to actionforangel.org and make a contribution to this campaign. This is very worthwhile and it may be the only hope of getting her out of the building and into a sanctuary.